Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video I'm going to show you how to build a powerful 12V evaporative cooler, also known as a swamp cooler, using easily accessible materials. This is perfect for small spaces, camping, or even as a DIY project. So let's get started. Here are the materials you'll need for this project. 1. A 12V switch. 2. A 12V water pump. 3. A 12V fan. 4. Aquarium tubing. 5. A 20 liter gasoline container. 6. Some basic tools like a drill, scissors and adhesive. Preparing the container. First take your 20 liter gasoline container and make sure it's clean and empty. This will serve as the main body of your cooler. Using a drill, make holes at the top where you will insert the tubing and the power cords for the pump and fan. Installing the pump and tubing. Next, we'll install the 12V water pump. Place the pump inside the container and secure it at the bottom. Attach one end of the aquarium tubing to the pump. Make sure the tubing is long enough to reach the top of the container and then some, as it will circulate water throughout the cooler. Secure the tubing in place and ensure there are no leaks. Now let's set up the 12V fan. Attach the fan to the opening of the container. You can cut out a hole that matches the size of your fan to make sure it fits snugly. Secure the fan with screws or adhesive to ensure it stays in place. The fan will blow the cooled air out of the container, so positioning is key. Wiring everything together. Now it's time to wire the components together. Connect the water pump and the fan to the 12V switch. This switch will allow you to easily turn the cooler on and off. Make sure all connections are secure and insulated to prevent any short circuits. Adding water. Fill the container with water. The pump will circulate this water through the tubing. You can add ice to the water to make the air even cooler. Once the container is filled, close the lid securely. Testing the cooler. It's time to test your DIY 12V evaporative cooler. Turn on the switch and the pump should start circulating water while the fan blows air out. You should feel a noticeable drop in temperature as the cooler starts working. And that's it! You've built your very own 12V evaporative cooler. It's an efficient and portable solution to beat the heat, especially in off-grid situations. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more DIY projects and creative ideas. Also, don't forget to hit the bell icon to get notified whenever we post a new video. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.